Hi Cancer, welcome to your love reading. This is going to be for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Venus and Rising. In this reading I'm going to let you know what's going on with your person, how they feel about you, what is going to happen for you in love in the near future, their next move and so on. Keep in mind these messages are general so they may or may not resonate. If it doesn't, you can always check your other placements. We have the King of Cups. Not the King of Cups, what am I saying? It's right in front of me, oh my gosh. We have the Knight of Cups. <laughs> and the Knight of Cups is always somebody who is coming forward to offer love. Why is the Knight of Cups here for Cancer? Oh my goodness. The Ace of Cups clarifies the, the Knight of Cups. This is definitely an offer. This is, if I, if I ask why the Knight of Cups is here and the Ace of Cups comes out, it's like straight up telling you because the Knight of Cups is here because someone has a love offer. Here we have the Nine of Swords. It seems this person has been dealing with a lot of anxiety. They could have been really upset about something really stuck in their head about something it seems that they've just kind of given up and decided to come forward what's with this nine of swords queen of wands and the sun could be dealing with a leo or an aries not aries pisces cancer scorpio maybe aries or the queen of wands or, Scor or sagittarius but um it seems that they were really, really in their head about this and then decided to just give up and come forward. Let me take a look at their spread. Show me this person for cancer. Show me their energy, their feelings. Show me this person. Their next move, Hierophant. Some of you may be married to this person with the Hierophant coming out. Okay. Could be a Sagittarius for some. See why they're coming forward. We have the magician, their feelings. They're kind of guided when it comes to their feelings. They're kind of, they kind of hold back here. They're seeing you as the three of swords. So this person knows that you're heartbroken at the moment, that you're hurt about something. They're aware of this. They have a fear that you might walk away from them with the Seven of Swords, like you might walk away for good, they could lose you. So this seems to be someone who keeps their feeling, like they try to keep their feel feelings under control because they fear the worst, they fear that you will leave. Um, we have the, the Knight of Swords in the center, which tells me you guys are going through a rough time in this relationship. The Strength card, Leo energy, again. Um, someone is struggling with that, with the strength aspect of being strong. Someone is feeling vulnerable. Someone's feeling weak. This person, they do plan to have patience and wait for this. Um, we have justice. Could be a Libra. But their next move seems to be to make things fair, make things balanced. I get the feeling this person is unsure how to do that, but they will try. It seems to be their intention to i'm here and make it up to you like they want to make something up to you um the ten of pentacles and the death card could be dealing with a scorpio so a position of what you need to know is if you're not committed this person does have commitment on their mind with the ten of pentacles they do have something more solid to offer you this time around i feel like they want to make things more balanced I feel like they have all the patience in the world to wait on you. The outcome is the death card. So this person, they are, 
they seem to want change, that they seem to want to change the way they've been doing things. They seem to want to do things differently now. I don't know if separation caused them to feel that way or caused them to want to step up. They seem to have all the patience in the world when it comes to this relationship because they even have temperance. Temperance and the Seven of Pentacles. They are waiting. They will make a move, but they're waiting for the right time. Or they have been waiting. What does this person have to say to Cancer? What's their message to Cancer? Okay. I struggle with revealing my true feelings and emotions. I struggle with expressing love. Sorry. I struggle with, with love and expressing it. I just it just does not come easy for me this is what they're saying these two cards very similar I struggle I struggle with revealing feelings with expressing it so basically this page of swords as their feelings they have their guard up when it comes to feelings they I feel like they're afraid <laughs> they're afraid to feel they're afraid to express it they're afraid to acknowledge it but they feel it they didn't feel it they wouldn't feel the need to come forward we have i'm scared you will not accept me now hurting you was not the plan the bottom we have i feel ashamed for how i treated you i did not sorry you did not deserve that so here we got someone who has trouble showing the feelings but knows that they hurt you they know they hurt you because they they're seeing you as a three of swords show me cancer oh my gosh the moon card could be dealing with a pisces or a cancer show me cancer here what can cancer expect from this connection First of all, let me get your near future. What's the near future for Cancer? What is in store for Cancer in the near future? Knight of Wands. King of Pentacles. Hanged Man. I see that you are... I feel like the, the stability that you're looking for, you're going to continue to look for it, whether you find it in this person or not. Um, I do see that you're, you're keeping, you're hanging around this relationship still, though. You might not let go of this right away. So you may, at this point, I feel kind of stuck because you're exploring, but you're holding on to this relationship so it's like it's like you're just kind of holding out hope that this person will step up and they do look like they will so it's like it's not really doomed or anything let me see what's going on here show me cancer show me cancer energy Okay, so there's an offer that you're rejecting here. It could be that you're rejecting them for now. We've got Leo energy again. Leo energy again. This is the fourth time. We've got Aries. Libra again. Aquarius now. So you have the Queen of Swords here as your overall. So it seems that you cut someone off or you've put your foot down about something you are rejecting someone's offer here with the four of cups um when it comes to the relationship some of you may have a child together but you're seeing you're looking at the positives here you're seeing your person as a three of pentacles so some of you may be kind of remaining friends or seeing them as it seems like you're seeing them as wanting to cooperate now, wanting to step up, or you will be seeing them as wanting to step up all of a sudden and do what they need to do. We have judgment and strength. 
you are definitely the one being strong so it seems that this is the person here who is kind of the weaker one this person who plays tough and doesn't show emotions they're actually the weaker one because you're being strong over here okay some of you are kind of nervous about what the universe has in store for you you might be unsure whether it's this person or a new person so kind of letting go and letting the universe do its thing is kind of scary to you it is in the position of your fears um, because you might just be afraid of the unknown like everyone else in the world we have the page of cups in the center and the star blocking you're needing to focus on self-love this might be a thing that the universe has for you this might be a plan the universe has for you to really focus on you for, for, the, for now I guess um, you may receive messages from this person. They may start to, you know, um, how do I put it? Uh, kiss up, I guess. <laughs> Beg. <laughs> Apologize. Um, I did see this for Scorpio, something similar for Scorpio. So I find that when I do the elements together, like for, for example, water signs will all be experiencing something similar to each other. Different story, but similar type of vibe, similar thing going on for all water signs. So there is this whole, your person kind of chasing you at this point, at the point where you decide to put your foot down because I remember um, the beginning of April, all the water signs were leaving. All the water signs were kind of walking away from their, their person. So now it looks like it gets to the point where your person is now starting to realize what they've, what they've lost or what they could lose. And they start to, you know, worry. They start to really worry. We have the emperor. Four of Pentacles, Justice. So your next move, it looks like you plan to really bust up. I mean, I do see you being strong about this and focusing on self-love. So it's like you, your next move, you, you, you become in control here. You are the boss in this because you start to see that your person is kind of chasing now. And I still, I mean, there's something that made you get to this point where you put your foot down but it's like doing that was the best thing and it was something it was done out of self-respect so now that you've done something out of self-respect you've now reached a level where the self-love will start to increase the confidence will increase and you'll be feeling a lot more comfortable a lot more powerful here so four of pentacles position of what you need to know I feel like this person is going to cling to you they're not gonna let go that easily even though you're rejecting their offer they're not gonna let go that easily um, and the outcome being justice and with justice being their next move it seems like they really make the effort to really balance this out and you to the point where you start to see how things are balanced and how they're actually stepping up so in an equal effort message for cancer we have triggered i feel like this person is triggered by the separation it's triggered them to have to chase we have manipulation and sadness and grief so they may have played games in the beginning maybe that's why you cut them off um couldn't deal with the games or the manipulation they probably try to change that now but I feel like you, f you feel that you've dealt with enough sadness, enough grief, you know? We have divine timing. I feel like, cause they have this, the temperance card. So they, they might feel like it's only a matter of time before you guys reconnect. Let me see what we got here. Messages for cancer. Finance and career, financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. Make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you got it to take. 
So they start to make the effort. They start to step up. Some of you may have had financial issues. They may start to step up and do something about it. We have, it's safe for you to love, open your heart to give or receive the highest energy of all. It could be that this person feels like it's not safe to love or felt that way in the recent past. Some of you may feel that way now about them. We have soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. So there's the chance still for this relationship, but it looks like there's just going to be a temporary break until they prove to you that it's worth it. What's the advice for cancer? Communication is key. Could be dealing with a Gemini. Bring love into the situation. Aquarius, you are good enough. Virgo, your commitment is being tested. So it could be dealing with Gemini, Aquarius, Virgo. Aries, Aquarius again. Very strong Leo energy. Libra, Scorpio. Okay. Um, communication is definitely key. Will you're good enough that does connect with the self-love aspect, needing to know that you are good, good enough. We have, with your commitment is being tested, I do see that with the Knight of Swords being in the center here, that this is definitely a test. It's a temporary separation. It may make your person start to step up and make the effort, and that's the good thing about it. So there's good in everything. Good comes out of the bad situations. So continue to stand your ground here because it will make your person, you know, really fight for this. And that's what you're needing. Okay, so cancer, this is what I'm seeing. Check your other placements if you want to know what else to expect here. Leave a like if you enjoyed. I hope this was helpful for you. Subscribe if you're new. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.